Hello there, welcome to Pace Event. In this video, I'm going to review Conduit AI Analyst, which is one AI analysis software that can work as a analyst of your company or as a business analyst of your company. They are saying that Conduit AI Analyst helps you connect and analyze business data, translating it all into meaningful insight that drive the growth of your company. And the thing that you can do is you can connect different platform that people use generally to run their business like uh, Asana, then Google Analytics, Google um, adver uh, advertisement platform, Facebook ads and uh, HubSpot. And they have a lot of other integration. You can integrate with these platforms and then this Conduit AI analyst will uh, combine all the data and then it will analyze uh, all the data and then it will provide you the uh, different types of answer different types of data different types of uh, analysis uh, that can um, be very helpful to grow your business actually and see this is the lifetime deal pricing of conduit ai analyst license tier one pricing is only 69 dollar and license tier two pricing is 189 usd but here uh, in license tier two you will get unlimited users or on license tier one you will get 10 users you will get 10 integration in license tier 1 you will get 25 integration in license tier 2 but if you need unlimited integration then you have to upgrade to license tier 3 and also if you need more sub account if you need more years of data retention and then c name and white labeling then you have to upgrade to license tier 3 so depending on your need just take the deal or tier that you like to get and in all tier you can get at least 10 percent discount just go to the description of this video and get the 10 percent discount on this conduit ai analyst now without further ado let's go to the dashboard of conduit ai analyst and let's explore how things work sir and how it can be helpful for us see guys this is the dashboard of conduit ai analyst they have google sheet add-on so you can install google sheet add-on on your google sheet and from your google sheet you can also get the data but they have some uh, built-in integration uh, here as you can see if i go to this import section from here you have to import your data and to import your data what you have to do at first you have to connect the platforms right so just click here on this create import and see from which platform you can import your data you can import your data from hda from amazon from amazon selling partner from asana from your bank account and from bigcommerce token from call rail from close io from facebook from, from fairing from fresh disk from fresh sale get wfm from google ads you can import your data from google analytics you can import your data from webmaster tool you can import your data see lots of platforms are available like hubspot instagram intercom auth jira clavio customer then linkedin mailchimp you can connect your microsoft ads also they have monday integration mod integration they have a uh, nebu mailer integration pinterest pipe drive then uh, quickbooks reimage so a uh, lots of platforms like salesforce acm rush shopify snapchat spotify ads then square stripe tiktok trello twitter ads type form response woocommerce Jero, uh, youtube zendesk joho a uh, lots of platforms that generally people use um, to run their business are available here so you have to import your data just by connecting these platforms so uh, let me connect one platform from here let's say i will connect my google analytics so what i have to do i have to just click here on this button and see here we can uh, connect google Anal analytics demo data also if you want to connect your real data you can connect your real data just by clicking here on this connect button so let me connect some um, from here and then i will come back again See guys, I have connected my Google Analytics. Now let's say I will connect some other platforms. Um, let's say I will connect my YouTube. So at the, uh, yes, here, this is YouTube. So let's say I will connect it. So let me connect it and then I will come back again. See guys, I have connected my YouTube account here. So it's very easy. Just click here on the, on the connect button and then it will ask you to authenticate or to authorize your account and then it will be done and when i have connected this youtube account it's asking for import let me click here on this import button and then as you can see here it's uh, redirecting me to this section and here still it's downloading 
as you can see it's down downloading the data it will take few time actually and then it will be done see guys here it's imported all the data from my youtube and i have uh, connected my youtube but in your case if you connect any other platform then these um, breakdowns these columns and this data everything will be different right and see they have uh, option to customize your table you can customize this table according to different breakdown according to different metrics see lots of metrics that are available and this matrix breakdowns they will be different depending on different platform actually and then they have column order let's say at first see they have channel id then they have channel name then they have date and then video id so let's say you do not want it like that you may want at first the uh, channel name so just uh, you can drag and drop it and then click on this apply and then the channel name will come first so in this way you can customize or you can change the column orders also and um, if you want you can export all the data from here just click here you can export as a google sheet as csv file also you can ask the ai and see they have uh, different template like ex, uh, export to ex, SQL database you can join this uh, data with other sources you can join uh, this data with another spreadsheet uh, and they have sales team leaderboard pipe drive so you can connect this data with other platforms uh, from here actually so let's say uh, I will export this data as Google Sheet so I'll simply click here and then here give a name let's say uh, OIT data and then uh, click here on this choose and then uh, select the spreadsheet where you want to keep it then click on this uh, select and then see that they have different option like add a row with a link to the configuration create a new sheet on fast export uh, and check the add-on is connected so let's say I will keep as it is and then simply I will click on this export and the data will be exported here hope you get idea and then they have ask ai so if i just click here on this ask ai section see they have copilot now here if you connect different platform then all your platforms you will be able to see from here and you can select a specific platform and then you can ask let's say i'll ask here one question what is the most well-known uh, or well-performed video of the pc1 channel as you can see the question is what is the most well performed video of the pc1 channel now if i enter it then let's see what it uh, reply us as you can see it's saying processing the query and then here it's saying that this is the well performed video they're saying actually here and we can see the estimated uh, minutes was we can say estimated uh, read minutes was estimated uh, read par partner review so lots of data there are available depending on this video and video duration in seconds is here so uh, according to them this is the most well performed video now i will ask let's say why do you think like that so let me send this question and then let's see what it uh, tell us See here is the answer. They are saying the video with the highest number of views is considered the most well-known, well-performed uh, because views are a direct indicator of how many times of uh, a video has been watched. This metric is often used to gauge a video's popularity and reach within the audience. So the thing is, you can connect your data, you can connect your platform, and then you can ask to the AI. Um, a different question about your data different question about um, and these uh, sources actually and it will answer um, after analyzing all the data hope you get idea guys and see these are the connections that we have explored here you can connect different platforms from here and then there and there have the copilot and here if i come to this copilot section here actually you can ask different question about different data and then here in the import section you can import different types of data after you you will connect let's say uh, after few days uh, some new data is available on your source now if you want to uh, can, um, import this data again just click here on this task section as you can see i have connected my youtube now if i just click here on this import option or if you click here on this button import option then the new data will be imported again and all your imports you will be able to see here inside this import section 
hope you get idea you can create new import also from here just click here on this create import and you can import uh, your data from different connected platforms actually hope you get idea i'm not importing right now more but you can import and then they have template they have some pre-made template you can use this template but we are not interested on this template we want to create everything from scratch to do it what you have to do you have to go to this dashboard section and you have to create your dashboard let's say i'll just click here on this create dashboard and here uh, let's say connection is um, google analytics and account is this account and this is the data schema and then if you have any workflow you can connect your workflow but actually you have to have the workflow so let me create one workflow at first just go to this workflow section and in the workflow you can create different types of automation actually see this is the workflow section and here drag and drop automations are available let's say at first you will pull the data so just drag and drop it as you can see at first uh, pull the data from which source let's say from youtube and then let's say what do you want to do after pulling the data from youtube what do you want to do you have to select now see there have different option that you can select like after pulling the data from youtube uh, you want to create a report or um, you can join by a key you can union of this data and then you can add some metric you can add one column see so a lots of triggers are available here actually and they have a lots of filter if then duplicate option change time zone so depending on your need you have to choose so let's say i want to create a report so i'll just drag and drop it here that means after pulling the data what i want to do i will create a report and where um, from uh, see source data set you have to select let's say pool one and there have view option if i just click here on this view then um, from here you can see the report actually or the preview of the report actually and see they have option to maximize or minimize this uh, interface actually from here you can um, have different types of sitting you can insert to a spreadsheet you can download it as csv you can share the link you can rename the data set so let's say we'll go to the sitting and see here in the sitting you can uh, have different option like show number of rows show column title raise an error when the filter data set is empty so these things you can enable or disable if you want if i go to this sections um, setting see they have some more so depending on your um, connected action depending on your connected trigger this setting can um, be different also hope you get idea so in this way you can create your workflow and workflow is basically one type of automation so if everything okay you can schedule when it will be uh, run let's say on every wednesday or on every friday you want to run this workflow then you can save it also if you want to run it right now then you can just click on this run workflow and then it will be run hope you get idea as you can see download report one as csv file or share a link so let's say i'll share this link here see this is the link and then now if i try to open this link then let's see what it provide us as the workflow as you can see here the data has been downloaded okay actually if you share the link actually when someone will open this link then this data or this report that means this csv file will be downloaded and people can open this csv file and then they will be able to get the data hope you get idea guys how this workflow will work as you can see this is one new workflow you can create as many as workflow you want and then they have dashboard now we want to create our dashboard just click here on this and then here select let's say from youtube connection is youtube and i'll select my account and here this is data schema and workflow is this workflow you can select the data set and date column and then here just click on this uh, create a table view and then depending on your input this table views will be created hope you get idea guys see here this is actually new workflow now if you want to refresh it you can refresh it and if any new data is available this data will come here so i hope you understand the basic of this software or the fundamentals of the software how it will work the thing is here you can import your business data from different uh, platform like from google analytics from youtube from ac from amazon from asana from your bank account 
from Facebook, from Page Desk, from a lot of platform. And then after importing this data, you can ask to the AI of uh, Conduit uh, different question about your business, different question about your data, and then it will analyze the data. It will provide you the answer. It will provide uh, you the informations actually depending on your workflow you can automate everything you can get automatic um, report in every day or in every week also hope you get idea guys how this conduit ai analyst will work so these are the things if you think you need this type of software that will help you to um, get the analysis of your um, business data um, depending on your need in every day in every week then you can get this conduit ai analyst lifetime deal from appsumo i will give the url of this conduit ai analyst lifetime deal in the description of this video just go to the description of this video and get the 10 percent discount on this conduit ai analyst lifetime deal it's an affiliate link guys if you use this link to purchase this amazing deal i will get a small commission without costing you any additional money so if you think guys this video is helpful for you then please consider using this link to purchase this amazing deal and the last thing is visit our website www.pacevan.com to get more tips and tricks about growing online business. Also, join our VIP lifetime deal discussion group through the description of this video. And if you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel yet, guys, then please consider subscribing this channel. Thanks again for watching this video.